but all over Nigeria is happening because they've seen and listening to what we're doing. They believe in what we're saying. And they believe in our commitment. That commitment is total. We're going around and preaching to everybody. All we want is to turn this country from consumption to production, remove the sharing formula, and replace it with producing production formula. Make it work. Unleash the talent and the energy of our youth and make the country productive for everybody, where people can be proud to say they are Nigerians. Today, Nigerians are not happy to say they are Nigerians. That's why they are looking for other countries to go and live. When we have one of the best places to live on the surface of the earth, when we have the vast land that is all over the place, not going to be cultivated, we want to be able to bring Nigerians together. Make sure that our cohesion, we're together as a nation, where we love each other, where we are not divided along religious or ethnicity, because I've not seen any road, any beautiful city built for Christians in Nigeria. I've not seen that beautiful place built for Muslims. I'm a Christian. I want to go to Dubai. Dubai is a Muslim country, but nobody talks about religion there because it's good. That's what I want to see in Nigeria. I want my children to go to Meduke and be happy. I want them to go to Kanu. I want them to go to Sokoto. And I want the people from Sokoto to go to Lagos, to go to Ibadan. Everybody living secure, doing his business freely and happy. The average Nigerian being pulled out of poverty. Each of us holding hands together and celebrating Nigeria. Sir, lastly, sir. What would you say to people that say the Labour Party does not have structure? The structure is the human being. The people I'm talking now, the people in Sokoto who are hungry are structure. The people in Ibadan who are hungry are our structure. The people in Calabar who are hungry are our structure. The people in Enugu 